Hi, my name is Brianna Goodwin. I am the Director of Operations at the Robinson County Church and Community Center. Today we'll be giving Healthy Robinson a tour of our facility and showing our new COVID-19 proof operations. Now, walk this way. We are offering direct service to our clients uh, Monday through Wednesday and Friday from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. That includes the food pantry operation as the primary direct service. Everyone in Robinson County is eligible to come pick up a box of food. All they have to bring is their ID uh, with proof of a Robinson County address and each box includes a certain type of protein, canned vegetables, a starch, and other miscellaneous items. Um, Robinson County residents are able to pick up that box once every 30 days. We recently received a commercial grade refrigerator from Healthy Robinson and that refrigerator enables us to store fresh produce which is something that we were not able to do before. Um, typically farmers or um, other entities would distribute produce items and we had to distribute them the same day or the next business day or they would go bad so now we have the opportunity to give out produce items over a week or two time span. You will also see our walk-in freezer. The temperature in the freezer remains at sub-zero temperature, so we have Alaska grade coats for all of our staff who have to spend prolonged periods in that freezer. And the storage capacity for the walk-in freezer is up to two and a half pallets of food products. We have a particular section in our food pantry with shelf-stable items. Those are primarily distributed to the homeless population, victims of domestic violence, or folks that have had a recent uh, burnout of their home. Most of those clients come in and they do not currently have a way to prepare food with a stove. So all of those items are ready to eat or can be prepared via microwave. You'll see our baby supply closet, which includes baby diapers, formula, and wipes. Uh, we also distribute supplies to the elderly and disabled, adult incontinent supplies, um, and that's diapers and wipes as well. We are also back to distributing the wheelchairs, walkers, bedside commodes, and other durable medical supplies. For that, you have to have a prescription or some kind of doctor's note stating that you need that supply and your ID. We are now back to accepting donations of food, diapers, and other hygiene supplies as well. 